Sports stories that we're following tonight. There was a scare on board the Butler basketball team's plane as they made their way home from their loss to St. John's. And a popular Indianapolis Colts player announces his retirement today. We've got Rich Nye in studio today with both of those stories. Hey, Rich. Good evening. The Butler basketball team is safe with no injuries on a bus on the way to Hinkle Fieldhouse tonight, but the team lived through 15 scary minutes in the air in the dark last night. Butler lost to St. John's last night in its Big East opener in Queens, New York. The team was flying home on its chartered flight when the lights went out and cabin pressure was lost. The plane made an emergency landing in Pittsburgh. Now here's a picture that was tweeted out by uh, Butler assistant Brandon Crone, and I just got off the phone with head coach Chris Holtman. It was 10 to 12 minutes of really, in some ways, like complete darkness and kind of the eerie silence with the exception of we could hear the pilots kind of navigating through all this, some of the challenges. And, you know, we heard her come on every now and then and remind our guys uh, to keep the mask on uh, at all times. So um, at the end of that, you know, 10 to 15 minute period, uh, she came back on when we got to 10,000 feet and said, uh, cabin pressure has returned. Uh, to normal. Again, everyone okay.